Some senators are throwing their weight behind the Ombudsman's probe into issues involving the health department. Man Los Baños with the details. Under the Bayanihan law, the health department has the flexibility to procure everything they need to fight COVID-19 without having to undergo bidding. But this, says Senator Sherwin Gachalian, comes with the responsibility of buying items at a reasonable price. The lawmaker welcomes the Ombudsman's initiative to launch an investigation into the alleged irregularities committed by health officials, including Secretary Francisco Duque III. He says it's about time that the Ombudsman looked into supposed anomalies in the procurement of PPEs for healthcare workers. Masakit to para sa ating lahat dahil naghihirap na tayo. Yung kakaunting binayad natin sa gobyerno, eh, napapakinggan na, na, natin na pumunta pa sa mga supplier na hindi maayos dahil nga sa DOH. For Gatshalian, Secretary Duque lacked foresight when it came to dealing with the health crisis. In Secretary Duque was given a lot of authority and a lot of leeway to suggest to the President on what measures we should take to address the potential pandemic at the time potential pa lang. Clearly, this is a health matter. Ito mga nangyayari natin economically, ano na lang to eh, kumbaga... Uh, resource na to ng health problems natin. And while the Ombudsman is doing its probe into issues surrounding the DOH, Gatshalian thinks that Duque should take a leave of absence, especially now that the bulk of the work right is on the shoulders of the task force. At the very least, so that magiging impartial in investigation because obviously you can, you can influence the information that the Ombudsman will request from the agency. Other senators like Franklin Rilon also support the probe against Duque and his agency. He said the people have the right to exact accountability and transparency from government officials because the lapses they committed put the nation at risk. On the other hand, Senator Ping Lakson hopes this time around, the investigation will find those liable and be made accountable for taking advantage of the COVID-19 crisis. Reporting for News 5, Me and Los Baños, we are One News.